Dana, a group of black teenagers is turned away from a public beach and now a lawyer is claiming racism. It happened in the well-to-do community of Manhattan Beach where things got so heated with police, the lawyer ended up in jail. CBS 2's Sean Hennessy explains. A sunny and beautiful day at Manhattan Beach allegedly darkened by the shadow of racism. Black kids were being told get out of the neighborhood. Brooklyn lawyer Gene Berardelli says this group of teens was denied access by police on Friday and he blames discrimination. It was definitely a black and white issue. Black teens were not allowed, not welcomed in Manhattan Beach. But police say the rejection rationale was simple and not racially motivated. There were several violent incidents on last year's senior cut day, a day when students skip classes, and so cops were out in large numbers this year to enforce the protocol. They either be brought back to the track site for truancy or brought back to the school where they belong. I mean, we wouldn't tell them, you know, we can't allow kids to cut out of school. But this lawyer says police couldn't have known which students were skipping because they didn't bother checking. There's no way they could know that they weren't cutting class because they didn't ask to see their program card. Police say the only students allowed on the beach Friday were those on a school-organized field trip. So all others likely belonged in class. Today, teens of all colors enjoyed a day in the sun and say they've been problem-free for years. I feel welcome here. We come here all the time. All we do is you come to, come to have some fun. These teens eventually went home on Friday, but Berardelli went to jail when police say he became belligerent. This is the desk warrant given by police after his arrest for disorderly conduct. Sean Hennessy, CBS 2 News. And not only would Berardelli be heading to court, but he also plans to file a complaint with the Civilian Complaint Review Board.